welcome to another video. Today we're going to be doing an unboxing. This unboxing is from DIY Digital Art. They did send me these items for review, so thank you to DIY Digital Art. So let's do the thing in the frame first, or the box. Well, it does come with a frame, so it actually is in a pretty decent box. It's, it's like made for maybe giving this as a gift. Um, so you probably aren't really supposed to open from the bottom, but that seemed easier to open. So, um, yeah, so it does come with a frame here, um, which we will try out at the end of the video. Um, so I won't even bother opening this. And here is the picture here. It's this cute little turtle. Eee, turtle. I don't know. <laughs> so there's an ordinary toolkit here. And these are special drills and... Um, it does look actually really, really clear here. So, and these smaller diamond paintings surprisingly come with a lot of some colors lots of times. So yeah, look at this long strip of color. So some blues here, some browns probably for the turtle shell, and the yellows maybe more for the turtle shell. Some more greens. I feel like I've seen these colors black and then looks like some marquees, some bigger blue drills and then some bigger blue drills of a different color and then some yellow here. So, so look out for the finish of this at the end because I just can't foresee not being able to finish this. Um, but you know, stranger things happen, right? I don't know. So yeah, look out for the finish of this at the end, and I'll probably also do the framing at the end also. So, and oh, this one is $10.50 on the site, and it's a 15 by 15. So, and the frame, in case you want, like, to see if it'll fit wherever you're gonna put it, is about 18 by 18. The frame looks kind of dirty, but I'm hoping that's just the plastic, but we will see. Um, so, next item. This one. And this one is some flowers, because, you know, what's my channel without some flowers, right? So, ordinary toolkit here. And these are round drills, and here it is. I think these are poppies. Oh, it's a poppy, my guess. Um, I think it's a poppy. What is the, the, the site calls it red and yellow flowers, which <laughs> I can see myself naming it exactly the same thing, but I think it looks like a poppy. Um, a very colorful poppy. So, Looks like there are 24 colors. It looks like the legend is all letters and there are DMCs and drill field. I don't know, the O and the G might get a little hard to see. Do you see? I don't know. There's a G and an O and of course they're both kind of red and they're right next to each other. Those might be a tiny bit difficult to read. Um, I could see the difference so might not be too bad but yeah, ONG. ONG, no. <laughs> but otherwise, it looks okay. Looks decent. I like the colors on this one. I mean, I chose this mainly because I like the colors. Um, I'm hoping that. Oh, wait. I didn't measure this sucker. It's also. Oh, this is $5.25 on the site, $5.25. And it's a 34 and a half by 20. It's almost 25. It's like. It's. It's close to 25. So. Drills. So this is the small one here. Some really vibrant colors here. I think I'm really liking the vibrant colors on this one. So some darker colors here. And then some really vibrant colors. Some really, really bright colors here. I like it. And I really like this color here. <laughs> and some pinks. 
so yeah this looks this looks pretty like maybe this actually will get done instead of just all my specials <laughs> we will see so next now I'm painting this one So this one is, I think, yeah, this is the one that's $7. Um, it's a special shape of diamond painting. So ordinary toolkit. And like I said, special shapes. And here it is. It's this um, sun and moon special shape here with some clouds. Actually, the plastic on this is actually a pretty decent um, thickness on it. I like it. So, it looks like there are 17 colors, and it looks like they're all pretty much symbols um, with a couple numbers and a few letters. And drill field looks very decent. I don't see anything that will drive you crazy. Well, at least drive me crazy. <laughs> So, where's my measuring tape? I had it over here. It's a 24 by 34, and it like it. I probably said it was seven dollars. So, and let's look at the drills here. So, some blue. I think this is the primary background. Is this blue here? And that's why you see a lot of it, and I see this blue a lot. Ooh, these are really pretty. Um, some AB mark, um, AB teardrops, some stars, some AB coated um, domey shaped ones, and then rhinestones. These are the regular drill size, the regular drill, the regular size rhinestones here. So I'm planning to also kit this one up. So. I might kit up everything that's in this unboxing. Whether they all get done is a different is a different answer and a different question. I don't know. <laughs> so next one. Well, it's also the last one. I guess I need some scissors. Scissors. Okay, I got it. So this next one is, guess what? It's a flower paper quilling a diamond painting. This one is $6.50, um, ordinary toolkit, um, special drills, and here it is. It's, I think these are orchids. Um, so, so, I don't think I've done an orchid one of these yet, so. Yeah, these are orchids, it looks like. Um, it looks like there's 11 colors and they're all just symbols here. Um, there doesn't look like, it does look like the code is on the drill bags here. And looks like some white drills and then some rhinestones in the purple green. I thought there would be more purples, but I guess not. Um, it'll be mainly white and then ooh, these like are little stars here like it's circles but implant um, imprinted with stars some yellow drills some marquees not marquees teardrops here here's the marquees here so so yeah I think I'm going to kit up everything in here so you'll probably have seen the kit up video if you watch kit up videos I know not all of you watch all of my videos and I get it um, <laughs> That's why I separate out my videos in categories, because I know some people don't like certain ones. So, yeah, so here is the last, oh, did I say this was 650? And oh, wait, I didn't measure this, in case, you know, you want to frame said sucker. This is a 24 by 34. So yeah, in case you don't remember everything that was unboxed in this video. So here 
is everything here. Um, you'll probably see these in a unboxing that has already passed. Um, but um, I'll work on some of these and I'll see you later. So I'm back and this one is done. So, so yeah, I think, I think this actually turned out really pretty, very simple, but like elegant. It's, it's, yeah. See, I didn't do it. Oh, FYI, I'm a massive slacker and all of these were downpainted by my mom. So, um, so yeah, here is the orchid. That's the original image there. It's, it's a 24 by 34. It's a partial with 11 colors, four of them being crystal rhinestones and seven specials. Um, this took my mom one day to complete and yeah, no, I think, I think it looks really, really beautiful. Um, yeah. It has a nice outline. It has enough specials to just make it pop. And I think I give, I give a thumbs up to the charter. So yeah, that looks great there. No issues. So next one is this one here. Um, this one was also done and painted by my mom here. Um, I think it actually looks pretty decent. Oh, and the eyes are actually not sticky. That's usually one of the issues I have with these ones that are full um, <clears throat> rhinestones and then they, they skip the eye. The eye actually is not sticky, so yay. Um, so let's see. This was a 24 by 34. It's I called it a full drill canvas with 17 colors. 10 of them were crystal rhinestones and seven specials. My mom took one day to complete this. And you know what I realized? I wrote this comment on the wrong thing. <laughs> so yeah. Um, but that comment was for something else. Um, so this was also done by my mom. And looking at it, I think it's beautiful. Yeah, no, it has, it has, um, it's a full coverage um, diamond painting with, oh, this one was not fully placed well, so let me fix that. There. Um, it, ha it has the full coverage, it has some beautiful colors, and it has enough bling, and it, I like the little stars on this thing. So, yep, here's a random drill. Um, so yeah, I think this one actually turned out really, really nice too. And I do like this contrast, like this side is a different color than this side. So even the, these round drills are a different color than over here. And then they have stars here. You yeah, know, I think it turned out really, really great. This one. So <clears throat> next one is this one here. So yeah, my mom actually did a non- special rhinestone specials and rhinestone diamond painting. So this is a regular diamond painting. I actually think it turned out pretty decent. Like here's the original image there. And I think it turned out um, pretty, I think it turned out pretty decent. Um, yeah, it's very, very colorful. So even though it's not a special shape one, it has some really vibrant colors here. So it's a 25 by 35, it's a full drill. Um, that was on poured glue with 24 colors. These are all rounds. Uh, my mom took two days to complete this. She did actually make a comment when she was doing it. So I wrote it down on the, on my journal, but, um, she told me Y and V drove her crazy and G and O drove her crazy. So, um, I have the same issue too. When Y and V are the same color, they could look very, very similar on the canvas. And she said G and O look very similar too. So... So yeah, that's what happens is like, seriously, there's so many colors. They're not even in alphabetical order here. And yet the, the two, the two G and O are both red and V and Y is both yellow. <laughs> I don't know how that ends up happening. I don't know if you, the, this, the, these letters just get generated randomly. I don't think so though. I think I swear I see W as 310 all the time. So <clears throat> I'm pondering if there's certain colors that go with certain letters and things like that. I could be wrong, but no, I think, I think, you know, for the size, this actually turned out really, really pretty. And I think it actually, it, 
it, it captured enough of the flower image here. Um, I think these are poppies. That's what I called it. I think it captured the poppies really, really nicely. It's, it's beautifully colorful. So, so yeah. And my mom is actually getting way better at the regular drill ones. Um, the original reason she didn't like the regular drill diamond paintings and preferred the crystal rhinestone ones is she had an issue seeing if it was upside down or not. And I think as she's just gotten more diamond painting experience, she I like when she she asked me always after she's done to check um if she missed anything. So she's actually been getting way better at like not missing anything. I was like, Ma thumbs up, you didn't miss anything. Or, Ma, look, nothing us upside down. So I think my mom's getting better. So, so maybe she'll do some more not special rhinestones. <laughs> so yeah, there's that one. <clears throat> and the last one, also done by my mom, like I said, massive slacker, <laughs> apparently. I'm getting my mom to do all the diamond paintings. It's this little turtle here. It's so cute. I like it. Um, so this turtle... It, I, it, it was a 15 by 15. It's I called it full because it's practically full. It's it had 16 colors surprisingly for this tiny thing. I've noticed that these little like um, little animal like little bubble um, rounds of 15 by 15, they tend to have a substantial amount of colors considering how small these things are. So it had 16 colors, 10 of them were crystal rhinestones and six specials. It took my mom one day to complete this one and this one came with a frame. So I'm going to frame this so that it's a real, so there, here's my contribution. <laughs> Cause I was saying that I, uh, my mom has been pretty much diamond painting all, diamond painted this whole, this whole um, unboxing here. So it seems like there's a little extra fluff there. So. Oh, okay. I was thinking, oh no, I'm missing the... So, frame. This has some sort of... Okay, so I'm gonna cut this out. And hopefully it'll just fit. And I don't need to do anything more. You know what? I'm gonna... I've been meaning to try to cut my canvases out this way and I figured this is a small enough one that I can do this trying out this. So what I'm going to just do is get a ruler and my blade here and in my cutting mat here and I'm just going to see if I'll be able to just cut the edges here instead of using the scissors. <laughs> And I figure so, so this will just be behind the the frame anyway, so if you see the little edges, it'll be fine. I figure this will be faster than cutting with scissors, right? That's assuming I actually cut through it. So yeah, I'm just getting a ruler and a blade and cutting it in between. This won't really work for a big one unless you have a really long ruler and a really long cutting mat, which those things exist. So I just kind of wanted to try this out and see, yeah, no, this is actually working out pretty well. Here. So, and then I just got the ruler and the cutting mat from the Dollar Tree once upon a time. I don't know if they're still there, but I'm actually very surprised by this cutting mat. Like, I've gone on this several times and I still don't see any cuts from it. So, so yeah, I think that that was a very fast way of cutting, right? I think better than cutting it with the scissors. So, let's see. Is it going to be... Yep, I think it's going to be the right enough size here. So this does look like it's a peel from both sides. So it says there's a film on both sides. So 
Um, and you could always just get one of these diamond paintings with the frame and then just switch out the picture. Um, and Okay, so I got that one there. Here's the picture. And yep, that's the top. I'm just making sure I know which one's the top. <laughs> and so I figured these would look really good in like um, a kid's room or a baby room or, you know, you don't need an excuse, right? You could just have it up. So, so there we go. It's all framed. Um, it does have a stand like that, so it could stand like this, but there is that one finished. So let me show you everything. That I think this is actually everything. I think everything that in this unboxing was finished. So yay, thanks to my mom. <laughs> Thank you, Ma, doing all the work. Me taking credit. No, <laughs> so yeah, here is everything. Oh, let me move you up. Here are all the finishes for this video. So thank you very much to DIY Digital Art for sending these items for review. And thank you to my mom for actually doing this. And thank you for watching and happy diamond painting. Bye.